Hi. So here in this question, we are given working alone. The times taken by Anu, Manu, and Tanu to complete any job is in the ratio of five is to eight is to ten. So this is the ratio of their time taken. Uh, now we know the ratio of efficiency is reciprocal to the ratio of time taken, right? So efficiency of Anu, efficiency of Tanu, and efficiency of Manu. The ratio of their efficiencies will be reciprocal to the ratio of their time taken. So ratio of efficiencies will be one by five is to one by eight is to one by ten. This will be the ratio of their efficiencies. Once we simplify this, this comes out to be uh, uh, this will be eight is to five is to four. Okay, ratio of their efficiencies will be eight is to five is to four. So from here I can say that efficiency of Anu is some eight x, efficiency of Tanu is five x, and efficiency of Manu will be four x. These will be their efficiencies. Now next part of the question: They accept a job which they can finish in four days. Okay. Now there is a job they can finish it in four days if they work together for eight hours per day. Now what is the work done? The total work done in the first case will be together their combined efficiency is how much? Seventeen x. Let's say this is efficiency per hour. Okay, this is eight x per hour, five x per hour, four x per hour. So total work done in four days if they work for eight hours per day will be seventeen x is the work done in one hour. So in eight hours work done will be seventeen x into eight, and in four days the work done will be seventeen x into eight into four. This is going to be the total work done. Fine. However, this is not the way they are doing work. What they are doing is Anu and Tanu work together for the first six days. Fine. Uh, we are given Anu and Tanu are working for the first six days, and they work for six hours and forty minutes per day. After that. Uh, the number of hours that Manu will take to complete the remaining job. Now Manu alone is working, and let's say the remaining job is done uh, in how many hours? We are we have to calculate the number of hours. So we have to calculate how many hours. So let's say Manu takes X more hours to complete the remaining job. Fine. Now from here, total work to be done is 17x into 8 into 4. This is the same work that is to be done in this case as well. So the total work done, 17x into 8 into 4, is the work done in the first six days by Anu and Tanu plus work done by Manu in the next x hours. Okay, let's take this as t hours because x is another variable that we have assumed here. So let's take this as t hours. So the total work done is equal to work done in the first six days when they work for six hours, 40 minutes. Now what would be the work done? Combined efficiency of Anu and Tanu will be 13x, 8x plus 5x, 13x. And how many hours are they working each day? Six plus 40 minutes is two thirds of an hour. So six plus two by three, which is 20 by three hours. They are working for 20 by three hours every day, and they are working for six days. So this is work done by Anu and Tanu in six days when they work for six hours, 40 minutes every day. Plus work done by Manu will be efficiency of Manu 4x into the number of hours which Manu works. Manu works for t more hours, right? So from here, first thing that we can do is we can cancel out the variable x here. Then we can again cancel out 4. So 4 goes, 1 remains, 4 goes, 5 remains, and 4 goes. So we have 17 into 8, which is <coughs> 136, which is equal to 6 goes by 3 two times. 2 into 5 is 10. 10 into 13 is 130. Plus 1 into t is t. So from here t comes out to be 6. So Manu alone will finish the work in the remaining 6 hours. Hence the answer to this question is 6 hours. Okay.